I've got to get this story in before because I know we're, we're tight-ish on time and I know you've got another couple of stories. But other measures of success for Danny, and we were talking about it earlier, remembering names. Now, I don't know if you remember not long ago, um, I've just called you Tristan, but I'm not sure if I should call you Justin or Tristan. Yeah, which one uh, is am it? Am I right? Because um, some of us get a little bit mixed up with names, don't they, Dan? Yeah, I do. Um, what, what is it? Um, is... Don't you remember what you did? What did I do? <laughs> I called you it was Tristan. You, for my you 21st. did. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, he did a video sp especially for your 21st birthday. And I, and, him, yeah. and I called him something else. Called... <laughs> you called him Justin the whole way through the video. Yeah. A five minute video and it wasn't just like Justin at the beginning, it was all the way through. <laughs> yeah, but that was probably your dad's script. <laughs> you know? But it, it, how did I get it wrong? Oh we all we all asked that as well. Horses. How did I get it wrong? <laughs> it wasn't even we couldn't even just count the, the worst thing about the whole no, entire... Do you know what the worst thing about it was? I thought Chris only had one son. <laughs> <laughs> I thought, how can I get it wrong? Yeah, but then you knew there was two, and then, then I found out there was two of you. Yeah, and then now there's three: Owen, Tristan, and, and Justin. Justin. <laughs> Holy mackerel! Oh, good. I, I, see, I can't keep up. I can't. I'm always the last to the party. So basically, I'm going to have to have a kid and call it Justin, and I can use the video for that you when he's twenty four. Yeah. Well, the funny thing is, my mate, good mate, son's called Justin. It's a name that that's in my head forever. Yeah. Glenn. Glenn's son called Justin. Yeah. So it's it's a name that I'm au okay fait with. It's just in. It's just got in, yeah. <laughs> it's... Hi, this is Danny John Jules, and this is a message for Justin from Express Coffee, no less. Yes, that of the Chris Palmer dynasty, you know? So, guess where I am, Justin? Uh, I'll give you a clue. One, the last time I saw your dad, we were here. So then got it? All right, there's another idea. This is what he was stuffing down his neck at all times of the day when he was here. The obligatory Rum. Lime. Ginger. Tea punch. Chaser. Always. That's the most important one before they find you on the beach, mate, with only your ass sticking out of the sand. <laughs> These things happen on your 21st, don't they? Eh? It all goes a bit pear-shaped, doesn't it? Now, I'm gonna have a little toast for you. Not the stuff that goes with butter. Oh, it's quite nice that. Um, well, as you know, there's the old saying, isn't there? You don't like that? All right then, just for you, I'm gonna do a special rendition of a number I did in my one man show that Matt's story had to be blackmailed to back. <laughs> anyway, just for you, Just in time, I found you just in time, before you came my time, was running low, I was lost, 
like a losing dice were tossed. My bridges all were crossed. Nowhere to go. Now you're here. And now I know just where I'm going. No more doubts or fear. Cause I found my way. For love came just in time. We found you just in time and made your 21 this love, 21 this lovely, 21 this lovely day. Happy birthday, Justin. Don't do anything I wouldn't do, especially in that Porsche. Cheers.